Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your 72 hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you God for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message. All right, let's see what's going on. What's the situation? Oh, the Ten of Swords. Okay, so something is breaking down. There's collapse here. Something was found out too. And somebody's like, look, you have to make a decision, right? Um, somebody just can't cope with the fact that this is happening. Somebody was blindsided here also. Somebody thought things were going in one way and, and then they went in a, for the, a complete opposite a turn. Um, this could be that a relationship was volatile anyway. It was like on the brink of being, of you guys being together, then on the brink of breaking up. Um, from day to day, you just didn't know what you were getting. There it could even been some backbiting where somebody feels like they were owed more praise, more, um, more better words should have been spoken about them, okay? Because of the things that they had done in the connection, in the relationship. Somebody's devastated with some news or an event that happened here within a connection. Also, there could be loss of life here. Somebody needs to deal with that also. Let's see what this is about. What's the advice for Virgo? Advice for Virgo. The Queen of Swords. You need to get real clear about how you're going to deal with this and deal with this person here. You need to put your foot down. You need to make clear demands, okay? Also, if you want to have newness in this relationship, in this situation, and whatever it is, you need to speak that speak that into existence also you're gonna have to let go of the old to have new you can't take the old with you into the new get counsel also before you cut someone off or cut them out but you're gonna have to be the executive in this connection maybe you're gonna have to be the bigger person you're gonna have to show up with some some real tough words either for the other person or just in terms of ultimatum or in terms of um, demands, make your list of demands, all right? Let's see, you've been through a lot also, and it's pushed you to a place of just asking so many questions, maybe even pushed you towards spirituality, trying to make sense of it all, all right? What's the outcome? The Two of Cups, very nice. So it's, it's a relationship where um, maybe you guys can come back together. There will be forgiveness. It's better for you guys to stay together or be together and not be apart somebody just wants you to let bygones be bygones or this is what you will do this could be a marriage also if not a marriage then it's on the you know like i said it's on the brink of marriage it could go up it could get down and it, you know it's it's just like really right now it's a make or break time there could be some healing here allow yourself to fall in love or allow yourself to be filled with love the both of you need to have some exchange here. Renewing of vows. Yeah, renew your vows to each other. There could be coming back together because there's forgiveness, maybe even reconciliation here. This is what I have for you, Virgo. I hope that it resonates for you. If it does, go over to the website. Book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Virgo. Many blessings to you.